Hey guys, Token Vaping, um, employed with Pacific Vapes. Uh, today's uh, flavor review that I'm doing today is um, it's a little more enjoyable for me to do. Um, the reason why is this is from a company that is based in Staten Island, New York. Um, and if anybody, if you guys have seen any of my other videos, um, you'll know that I grew up on Long Island. So anytime that I can do uh, a support or a video review or any type of uh, promotion to help further a, a company when they come out of that area it's always a, a bonus or plus for me kind of feels like I'm giving back a little bit to uh, my hometown area um, now I've never had the, the pleasure of meeting these guys um, but they've been really helpful and really informative as far as um, teaching me uh, their process and everything else for this line. They were also generous enough to send me a few of their flavors to do. Um, the line is called, sorry about the glare, um, it's Lion's Den Elixirs with the Omega symbol and the lion's head in the middle. It's actually a really cool logo. Um, this is a Max VG line. Uh, they do currently right now offer it in a 0, a 3, and a 6 nicotine level I believe. Um, and they are offered in multiple sizes. Um, this is the 30 ml bottle. Uh, they do make them in a 60. I believe I've seen some pictures posted on them in 120, so I'm sure if there's not readily offered that they do custom build them. Um, if you email them at lionsdenelixirs at gmail.com, they can give you in pricing and sizes and everything else like that. Um, they're, re they're really quick to respond back. Um, I've not had a problem getting a response back from them at all. Um, they've been really, really on top of it as well, and that's always nice to see in in, in any type of company, um, things like that. But as you can tell, it, they are in clear bottles. There was three, um, there was three flavors that they sent me, and I will show them all, all three of them to you here real quick. I just need to verify um, the name uh, flavor. Uh, connection to it um, they are in in the they're in a smoky uh, glass bottle which looks really really cool they have the child safety cap on them as well um, they do they are they do have a, a seal lock like when you go when I went to unlock uh, one of the bottles it does do that little pop um, so that you know that it wasn't readily ha uh, tampered with uh, there is the nicotine level there the uh, warning label ingredients and uh, handcrafted in the USA is all on the back now this is the Savannah that's the first of the three that they that they offered Let me get that out of the way there this is the triple X this one here and then the third one that they sent me is Yoohoo now as I stated, that is a Max VG line. The one thing that surprised me with this line being Max VG um, that I haven't encountered readily before, um, these do have a little bit stronger of a throat kick than I than I was expecting. Um, but it's nothing har too harsh. It's nothing bad. Um, I just want to make sure that you do know that it is there. Uh, most people, you kind of get used to the higher VG in, in a juice line, um, the more subtle or non-existent of a throw kick that there is. This definitely does have a bit of a throw kick, um, but I think in this particular si situation, um, I believe I feel that it kind of adds to the uh, the overall vape experience. Um, I have had some juice, juices that uh, have a strong throw kick uh, compared to them, um, and sometimes it was a little bit, it was a little harsh. Um, but this one is, like I said, it is there, um, but it's not so uh, overpowering that it, that it takes away from um, the vape. Now, the three flavors that they sent me, as I stated, this is the Savannah, this is a peach lemonade. Um, absolutely on point. You open the bottle and you take a smell of it, you definitely smell the peach. When you vape it, honestly, it literally is like drinking a peach lemonade. Um, the, the first inhale and the main vape of it is the peach flavor. Um, towards the end of the vape and the exhale, you definitely feel like you just had a, a sip of lemonade. You get that, that tart bite to it. Um, which is really enjoyable. So they, I mean, it was definitely on point. Now, as I said, they sent me uh, three flavors to try. There are uh, 
two other ones, I believe, um, that I haven't had an opportunity yet. But if they're anything like these three, this entire line is a solid on-point flavor-wise. Um, the Triple X is this one here. And if you notice when you look at it in person, it has a cranberry, if you've ever seen cranberry juice or cranberry cocktail, it has that color to it. Um, but this pretty much is a match to the vitamin water drink. Uh, the, um, it's the acai berry, blueberry, and pomegranate. Um, it has definitely got a, a, a berry bite to it. Um, I've only had that drink a couple of times um, that I remember. I'm, I'm, I'll be honest, I'm not going to say that I remember the taste of it perfectly. However, there's a few other people that have been um, given the opportunity to do the review on this line too. Uh, I believe one of them actually stated that he drank it as he was vaping and he said that he really couldn't tell the difference. So that's really impressive that you can match a flavor that dead on. Um, the final flavor that they sent me is the Yoohoo. Now, it's spelled out as you who but as you can tell from the name of it, it's meant to taste like Yoohoo, which for the fact that it's clear, this is the part that gets me. It's a clear liquid. Vapes clean. All of them vape clean. They don't gum up your coils. They don't soak down your cotton to where it becomes a mess. Um, it's a clear liquid, but you definitely get the chocolate milk taste. Now, I'm not a big Yoohoo fan, so I didn't drink a whole lot of it, but it definitely tastes like chocolate milk to me. So I, I know Yoohoo has a little bit stronger of a taste um, than just regular chocolate milk, but it's pretty much on point for that. Um, the only difference between the three set, this I think probably was my, my favorite flavoring of the three. Um, however, they did unfortunately run out of a three nick in that and it's only a zero. So because I do vape nicotine, I can't vape a zero too long before it starts to get me. I have to switch over to something with nicotine. So as you can tell, I've been vaping on the Savannah a bit. Now that's not to say that I don't like the, I didn't like the triple X one. I just haven't gotten around to it just between the three that would be my third choice um, as far as flavors just because it's not um, it's not the main uh, flavor choice that I go with but it's still a solid on point flavor um, Max VG so you know you're definitely gonna get clouds I will show that here in a minute um, they're on they don't have a set website yet um, they are on Instagram um, and I believe uh, they have a, a Facebook if I'm not mistaken, I could be wrong on that. Um, but right now they do uh, sell out of their shop in Staten Island. Um, but if you do email them or contact them um, on Instagram, um, they do uh, they do ship out. So just because you can't get to them and into the shop does not mean that you, that they're not willing to work with you and and send you out some of this juice for you to either try, for you to purchase, for um, if you're a shop to reach out and try to sample. Um, they do have a couple of, of well-known um, vape, uh, female vapors that they do sponsor. Um, vaping on Gin and Juice is one of them. Um, my One of my newest uh, um, female vapor crushes, um, Jess Overcrew, um, I just, I love her eyes. She has beautiful eyes, but she's part of their, the Lion's Pride um, that they uh, that they put together as far as their, their uh, that group. There's a, a couple of other um, Bella Vapes I know is part of a part of them, as I believe is Fit Vape Bunny. So, um, Fit Vape Bunny. I apologize. So, if you're not already following these females, they are connected with a lot of uh, good quality companies. Um, definitely give them a reach out and follow as well. Um, but as I stated, it's definitely. Um, it's a solid, solid line. These guys have done their homework. They've taken the time to put the quality and um, the dedication into making a juice line that is worthy of saying that it is a high quality juice. Um, they've made sure that they do follow, you know, all the proper uh, behind the scenes manufacturing processes. Um, the quality control on these, you can definitely tell is there because of how on point everything is. It vapes clean. You know, it doesn't have a burnt taste. It doesn't have a a metallic or soapy taste to it. Um, they definitely have made sure that before it leaves leaves their, their facility that it's definitely what they're trying to put it out there as and what they're trying to promote it as. Um, very, very good job on all three flavors completely on point tastes exactly the way that it's stated now I'm going to show you real quick because I want to show you the cloud production on this as it's being 
a um, Max VG line. And as you can tell, when you drip it, it definitely does have the, the much thicker um, aspect of it because it is a Max VG. So as you can see that, it definitely is thicker than, than some others. Um, and as always, as of late, I am running 60 watts um, on my Skelly. So here we go. Lines Den Elixir. This is the Savannah, which is the peach lemonade. Really? Solid clouds. I mean... It's, I could cloud up the, the camera right now, but then it would just be a... Yeah, that's how solid they are, is that when I exhale the smoke, I basically block out everything for a few seconds so that I can't see through. Um, taste on point, again, like I said, first inhale is peach. Um, the follow-through is a solid... Uh, peach lemonade and then the end you basically feel like you just swallow lemonade um, It is impressive how on point this taste is it is definitely definitely worthy of stating that It not only is a high quality, but the flavor is on point if you've ever had peach lemonade Even if you haven't had peach lemonade most people have at least had lemonade you at least will taste that in this if you like peach you this will not disappoint you at all if you like clouds this will not disappoint you at all and as I stated there is a slight throw cake that you do feel um, but it is not enough to to make you look at it and go wow that's too harsh I can't do that Great clouds, great, great clouds. Um, it's one of those juices that you have to be careful not to vape too much at once if you're in a small area because you will cloud up really, really fast. Um, beyond that, it's a very solid line. There's not, there is actually nothing negative that I could say about this at all. Um, you know, as as a reviewer, most reviewers, um, you know, we 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 aren't partaken in any type of sponsorships or things like that with companies uh, due to the fact that um, we try to maintain an unbiased opinion and uh, as I always state you know this is entirely my opinion I do not for any way shape or form try to say that I'm speaking on behalf of anybody else um, everybody's taste palette is completely different um, nobody's gonna have the same exact one so I basically am just this is purely just how I take to the flavor and how I feel that it would come across for the vaping community. Um, I'm sure there'll be a lot of people that would thoroughly enjoy this line of e-juice. I'm sure there are probably going to be some people that it just may not fit a niche for. That's okay. There are more than a few uh, juice companies out there that are not going to appease every single vapor there is in this world. Um, however, I will go out and say that Lines Den Elixirs they have definitely hit a solid home run with this line. Um, unless you have a very specific taste palette, or if you are somebody who is more flavor than you are uh, clouds, those are about the only two th reasons I could see that somebody might say that this isn't the, one of their choices for an all-day vape or just to vape in general. Um, it most definitely is worth the investment. Um, it most definitely is worth at least trying. If you're a shop out there, definitely reach out to them. Try to get some samples into your shop. Give them a try. Um, unless, again, unless you have a clientele that has very specific um, tastes in, in what they vape, um, this definitely would not be a bad choice to stock on your shelves. Uh, Lion's Den Elixirs, I thank you so very much for allowing me the opportunity to to have tried your, your juice line. It is amazing. You guys have done a great, great job with this. Um, I'm honored to have had the opportunity. Um, again, vaping community, you can hit them up on Instagram. You can email them at lionsdenelixirs at gmail.com. I'm Token Vaping, tokenvaping at gmail.com. 
I'm on YouTube, Instagram, Facebook. Definitely hit me up. Give me a follow. Give me a like. Subscribe. Whatever you want to do. Even if it's, if it's just a, to say hi, if it's a constructive criticism, if it's just something to say, hey, you know, there's a company by me or I've heard of this company, you know, is there, do you know anything about them? Is there anything that you could uh, shine a light on as far as to uh, how they are? I will definitely do everything that I can to reach out to those companies um, and try to help further promote their brand. Um, if nothing else, just at least to help explain how they taste, um, how they come off to me, you know, show you what the cloud reduction looks like um, from their juice lines of, of how the flavoring is and everything else. Anything that I can do to support and further promote the vaping community as a whole, I will absolutely 100% do. I firmly believe in this in this community. Um, I am, a, I am a, a stout supporter of vaping as a whole. I definitely do recommend it over smoking, especially if you're trying to quit smoking. I am a reformed smoker myself, so I know it works. Um, but I am blessed to be able to have had this opportunity. Lions Den Elixirs, thank you again very much for that. Um, vaping community, again, token vaping, employedwithpacificvapes.com. Till next time, vape on, vape strong, guys.